He's Colorado's first ever first gentleman. Marlon Reese is the longtime partner of our governor, Jared Polis. He certainly doesn't crave the public eye, but he's already making his mark. Our political specialist, Sean Boyd, talked with Reese in this first sit down interview for him. Colorado's first first gentleman, Marlon Reese, is in the spotlight, but he admits out of his comfort zone. I'm shy by nature. I'm a bit of an introvert. The opposite of his partner. He came to you and said, I'd like to run for governor. What was your reaction? I was a nervous wreck. As for Polis. What is that line? You know, there's the, no try, there's only do, right? I said a, a Yoda line, maybe, I think, <laughs> <laughs> from Star Wars. So, you know, but that's his attitude. While not married, the couple has been together 16 years with dog Gia and kids, seven-year-old CJ and four-year-old Cora, who Reese says can bring levity even to an inauguration ceremony. And then we sat down and she said, I need to go potty. I said, oh boy, Cora, how many times did I ask you in the last hour if you needed to go? And you said no, but you can actually get a little, get a kick out of the process and how surreal it is. While a reluctant participant, Reese has now embraced his new role, making animal welfare his cause. I grew up with five cats, even though I have an allergy to cats. So for me, this was a no-brainer. Too often animals don't have someone speaking on their behalf. The LGBTQ community also has a friend in the first gentleman. The significance of that hit Reese at Pride Fest. I remember people coming up during the parade and they were emotional and saying how much this meant to them. But he says they aren't your stereotypical gay couple. People assume that we dress well or we are good dancers or that we uh, have designer clothes. And that's not true. This is so not true. He may not be a hipster, but Reese is a trailblazer. If only he says he could figure out how to get time with the governor. I think I need to go through your scheduler so that I can, I said, can I have a half hour with the governor? Despite their busy schedules, Reese says he and Polis have kept up their tradition of winding down each night, playing a video game, the same game, Age of Mythology for 16 years. Must be a good one. I'm political specialist Sean Boyd covering Colorado.